Hi, I'm Kairi Okikulu. Here's your Channel's TV Evening News Recap for December the 2nd, 2021. The Federal High Court sitting in Abuja has ordered the Department of State Services to allow the leader of the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra and Namdi Kanu maximum possible comfort while in their custody. Justice Binta Yako, who gave the order, also brought forward Kanu's trial to January the 18th from January the 19th, 2022, following the abridgment of time granted by the judge after a plea to that effect. In Kaduna State, 233 teachers have been dismissed for presenting fake credentials at the time of their employment. The chairman of the State Universal Basic Education Board, Tijani Abdullahi, told a news conference today that the teachers were sacked after inquiries from the institutions they claimed to have attended showed that their certificates were fake. An Emirates airline says it will resume its passenger operations between Dubai and Nigeria on December the 5th. The resumption of services comes 10 months after the carrier suspended flights to Nigeria after a diplomatic row between the two countries over COVID-19 protocols. On the international scene, Germany is set to ban those yet to receive the COVID-19 vaccine from entering certain venues including bars, restaurants and cinemas. The unimmunized will also be banned from Christmas markets as well as being hit by contact restrictions limiting the number of people they can socialize with. And in sports, Ralph Ragnick has been granted a work permit to start his reign as Manchester United manager. The 63-year-old German will be introduced to the media on Friday and take charge of the team for the first time at Crystal Palace on Sunday. And that's the Evening News Recap. Don't forget to join us later for the latest updates. I'm Kairo Kikulu. Thank you for watching.